Hi everyone, Deathclaw Girl here, and welcome to another one of my videos. You can help support this channel by subscribing and liking, and by grabbing some of my free ebooks and audiobooks. Also, go check out my super duper wasteland number one. Just drop the first uh, book is 99 cents. It's a fundraiser for my channel. Now let's get to this video. We're just going to be going through all the rewards for season 16. Bedesta has dropped them so that we can check them out. So let's get started. So here is a page one. You can see the Pith Helmet. All I'm going to be hitting on is unique and not repeats. Heating up player icon. Big feet rug. Rip daring outfit. Peppers, paint, a double barrel shotgun, and cold shoulder. And of course, your first 5% uh, booster, which you can grab for free. Uh, also at the end, since they have dropped all the rewards, what I'm going to do is I'm going to calculate to see if you can actually grab all the rewards by the time you hit level, <clears throat> sorry, level 100. All right, let's go to page two. So I'll be doing that, <coughs> excuse me, at the end if my voice holds out. Okay, uh, devilish T45 paint, rose room poster, Jersey Shore vacation photo mode, beach fence set, there is Adams, a hot dog sign, ship wheel, surfboard wall decoration set, also, I have heard, uh, we'll see when we get to the end, that they have actually removed the atoms from uh, over the 100 mark. Used to, you could every 10 times grab atoms if you, you know, kept going through the scoreboard. So one of the biggest things that people came into, you know, to continue the, doing the score was to grab these atoms. But we'll see if they actually have removed them or not. My other concern before I continue is how is Fallout First going to work? Originally in the old uh, scoreboard uh, way that they did it, when you hit a rank, sometimes there was a free Fallout First thing. So yeah, we'll see. I don't know. Since you're paying tickets for some of that stuff, it doesn't sound like they're free anymore. Yeah, for having the subscription. All right. Tropical Cryptid Shirt Outfit. Tiki music box. I wonder if it plays. Surfboard shelf set. Gun show player icon. Cryptid tiki statues. Glass float lights. And a tiki torch. Yes. All right. Pepper paint, a lever action. Duel with the devil poster. Jersey devil player icon. Devilish excavator paint, rip daring flag, another atom, and the cremator. This one I'm looking forward to. I think it's a flamer. I'd like to see if it's like a four star or not. So I'm actually looking forward to that one. And also this light ally, Adelaide. Toy robot set. <laughs> You could always collect these, but yeah, you, you could only put them in shelves. So now I'm thinking you can put these anywhere now. So these are the ones I believe that are in the game that are kind of like the chess pieces. So yes, here's the chess board. So, oh, awesome. So they finally have given us a chess board display and here are the little chess pieces. Awesome. But yeah, you can find them in game, but if you find the ones in game, you won't be able, to, I don't, well, maybe you can. I don't know. We'll see. Ball Buddies. <laughs> Wilson! Bullseye Trampoline. So there's already a trampoline, but this is a bullseye. That's a Fallout first. Here's the Adelaide Player Icon. A pepper Paint for the Goss Rifle. I think I covered everything on this page. Let's continue. Hanging Tire Baskets. I'm assuming they already have stuff in them. Construction barrier. That looks actually cool. That's a fallout first. Cage sign. Also fallout first. Since I'm mentioning a lot of fallout first, let me go ahead and explain what I understand when you buy the $1,500 of, uh, sorry, 1,500 atoms to grab the fallout first rank up. You're not actually purchasing fallout first. So keep that in mind. You're not purchasing 
fallout first, you are purchasing the right for that season only to claim all the fallout first items. So if you purchase that 1500 atom, I forget what it's called, season thing, it's actually not the fallout first subscription. So all you're getting is the ability for only season 16. So it doesn't matter when you purchase it, during season 16, you'll be able to go in and collect the fallout first, as long as you have the tickets for them. Now, I guess this one's actually zero. I was afraid that none of them were zero, but this is 15, I don't know. That was one of my concerns is that, yeah, uh, Fallout First members aren't getting, yeah, are they actually including this amount in the, I don't know if you can see it down here, but the 15, 25, sorry, 2,500 tickets available for the first 100 rewards. All right, yeah, we'll have to see. I don't know. I wanna calculate it at the end. All right. Raider cages, and here's the paint for the auto axe and the devilish paint for the union power armor. More atoms, construction loader. I'm assuming it's only for display and doesn't do anything. Um, Hellcat paint for devilish, peppers paint for that new cremator weapon, Jersey Devil's shoe flare, oh, like a horseshoe. Jersey Devil's horseshoe rug. Oh, it looks like he's been stepping on it. <laughs> Daring binoculars. Now I'm assuming these might be usable and not just a display because you can use binoculars in the game if you don't have a scope yet and find binoculars. Yet yeah, you can um, slot them like a weapon and use binoculars. So I, I, I'm assuming that's what this is. Maybe, I don't know. It could be just a display. And then here is a skin for the backpack, Cryptid Skull. Let's keep going. All right, here is another paint for the cremator. Sh oh, sorry, Slow Burner. Oh, there's actually a mod. This is a mod for the cremator, Slow Burner. Um, water boiler. Now I'm assuming this is going to be like a resource or a, you know, at least a water thing. So I'm looking forward to seeing what exactly that is. Devilish ultrasite paint. And then we got the repeats. So I'll skip those. Uh, devilish for the T65 power armor. Cryptid hunt wallpaper. Pepper paint for the shotgun. Now here is the heavy mod for the cremator. Not sure what these are going to be. Devilish player icon. If anyone knows what the mods do, please throw them in the comments. I'd really like to know because I might skip some of the mods if I don't want them. Then again, maybe I should grab them all while they are available. Who knows, right? Uh, field research poster. World of Cryptids trunk. I'm assuming this will either be like a stash box or something to that is just for looks for your camp. All right, covered everything there. A Brahmin corpse. <laughs> Don't have enough of those. Good luck emote. Oh, that's new. Okay. Devilish for the X01. Wet floor sign. You can grab this when you go to Atlantic City, but because it is junk, you can't do anything with it. So this one, you should be able to place like on your actual floor. So this will be nice if you like those. You already have them and actually want to do more with them. Mystery Magazine Package Times 3. Oh, that's new. So they're throwing out magazines in a package. I don't think they had that last time. They just had the mystery boggle, bobbleheads. Autopsy Table Chemistry Workstation. This is one of the ones I'm actually looking forward to. I'm hoping there's some good animation going with it. <clears throat> it looks like there is a body. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I'll be doing hopefully a turn location of this later on. Looks like it's pretty far down the list. So yeah, I don't buy ahead and then just do the entire scoreboard in one hit. I actually do the score daily and yeah, collect these as I go. All right, grass roof kit. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Oh, who's actually looking forward to the Fallout TV series on Amazon? I know a lot of people are expecting like the worst. I'm expecting, uh, what I want out of the series is a good story and somewhat in the Fallout universe. I'm not asking for a lot. I'm just asking that it does actually feel like Fallout. Um, uh, it's okay if they don't go hardcore with it, but yeah. All right, 
Nape Palmer Mod for the Cremator, Pepper Paint for the Plasma Caster, Pine Barrens Wallpaper, and, whoops, I think I done, yeah, there we go, sorry about that, and Jersey Devil Shooting Gallery. My mouse is getting a little move happy. Let's go to the next one. Jersey Devil Stein. This Stein is different from the other Steins. I noticed it in one of the commercials, I believe, because it's not metal looking. It looks painted. But it looks really good if you like the Steins. If you don't like the Steins, then yeah, you're going to say, who cares? Um, barrel mods for the Cremator. Sounds like maybe a multiples. A bunch of them come with this package right here. Beach Guinevere Player Icon. Uh, devilish for the T60 power armor and handmade <laughs> xylophone. Now, if you just love, love that first <laughs> xylophone that came out, you're going to have to have, have to have this homemade <laughs> version. I, I would be happy if it just sounds different since it is a homemade one, maybe out of tune or something. Uh, but they probably will just give us a yeah, new skin on the old version. But I would be happy if it just sounds out of tune. Um, okay, Devilish for the T51 paint. Oh, also, I'd love to hear your comments. What do you think about this board, the upcoming Atoms? Um, if they actually do remove them past the 100 mark, because uh, you see the score rank at 101, you start doing just the extras. There's no actual rewards. But... I would definitely be disappointed if they don't continue the atoms. I do see that it looks like they have raised them. I thought they were 150 or 100. I'll have to go back through the old seasons. If anyone just can off the top of their head remember, were they always at 200 or were they like 100 and 150? All right, let's get going. Duel with the Devil player icon. That one's nice. It's got a little forest. Devil's Wings Jetpack. Ooh, okay. I'm assuming for all jetpack variants. That's what I'm assuming because it doesn't give any here. So you do need to be able to build a jetpack. I'm assuming this is power armor. Uh, it still would be cool for the regular armor. I don't know. I just can't tell which one it is. Maybe it's for both, but I doubt that. All right, framed duel with the devil wall art. Now this is big. It looks tiny here, but this goes almost the entire length of a wall. I've seen it in one of the commercials. Cryptid hunter paint. Um, I have no idea. Is that power armor? I think it's power armor. It doesn't say which set. Is it regular armor? Is it a special armor? I don't know. I guess we'll have to find out in the future. All right, last two pages looks like, at least for the regular rewards. Uh, stairs, Pine Baron's Log Cabin, Pepper Paint, Combat Rifle. Oh, we got another gorilla statue. Looks like we got, this is the shelf, surfboard shelf set. So for the surfboards, gives you a way to hang them looks like. Pine Baron's Cabin Kit. Chemical Color Mods. Oh, this is for the Cremator. I don't know what it, chemical color changes maybe how it, the color of the spray. I'm assuming it's like a flame. Oh, here's more sports balls, but these don't have faces. Cryptid Cyclops Power Armor Helmet. Oh, okay. So that's probably Power Cryptid Hunter Paint. That looks different though. I don't know. I don't know if it's power. This is definitely power armor helmet. All right. Road signs. Looks like there's a bunch of them. Surfboard wall decoration set. Okay. So that's the wall. I, I don't know if it's just another set of surfboards or what. Okay. And all right. Yep, this is the extras page. So this is, you just, if you want more perk coins, legendary cores, mods, carry weight, lunch boxes. Yeah, I don't know how this page is gonna work, but they're right. Rank 150 and claim 95 season rewards to unlock this page. 
reach rank 150 and claim 95 season rewards to unlock this page. Okay, that doesn't make sense. They rank rank 100, 150, that's 50. Yeah, okay. This is, I have no idea what's going on. But a bonus, oh, it's only page two. Okay, I don't know if you can see it up here, but it says bonus rewards page two. So let's go back. Bonus rewards page one. Okay. So I'm assuming this is bonus rewards page one that they believe complete challenges. In my opinion, they're they're saying, since this is bonus rewards page one, that this is rank 101 and above that you can get to this page. But there are no extras. And then you have to wait to rank 150 to reach rank one and claim 95 season rewards to unlock this page. What is 95 season? Okay, if if anybody understands this, please, please tell me what they're talking about. What is a 95 season? Are they just not able to, to write 16, 16, season 16? Are there 95 rewards? As soon as you hit rank 150, you can unlock them? I don't know. Okay, now what we're going to do is start at page one. And I'm getting out my handy dandy calculator. And I'm just going to add up all the points and because, yeah, I'm just seeing because you're getting the first hundred ranks, you're going to get 2,500 tickets. So let's go ahead. So if you want to hang around for that, then we'll talk about it. Okay, so 25 plus 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus 0. I'm skipping that. Plus 5 plus 4. 40 plus 15 plus 5 plus 45 equals 150 on that page. I'm saying them out loud just in case you notice I skipped one. That way you can tell me and we can recalculate the numbers in case I do skip it for some reason while I'm live. All right. And then we got plus 45 plus 5 plus 15 plus Five plus fifteen plus twenty five plus thirty zero plus five plus thirty. So we're at three twenty five right now. Plus thirty plus five plus twenty plus thirty plus. 40 plus 30 plus 25 plus 25 plus 5 plus 0. So 535, if I did that one correctly. All right, plus 35. Again, that number I think was 535. I already hit the plus, so I don't know exactly the total count from the previous one. And again, I'm just repeating. I started with plus 35 for this page, plus 10, plus 5, plus 15, plus 5, plus 0, plus 45, plus 15, plus 15, plus 55. I have a total of 735 for that page, plus 40 plus zero, plus five, plus 15, plus 10, plus five, plus 30, plus 25, plus 20. I'll try to remember to do timestamps so you can just maybe skip to the end. And then plus 50. 935 for this page, plus 20, plus 15, plus 5, plus 0, plus 20, 
plus 40, plus 45, plus 20, plus 5, plus 30. 1135 for that page. And we're not, okay, we gotta remember the last two aren't actually regular pages. All right, plus 45, plus five, plus zero, plus five, plus 10, plus 25, plus 40, plus 25, plus 25, plus 45, 1560, Page nine plus forty five plus five plus fifteen plus five plus five plus thirty five plus forty plus zero plus ten plus 40 equals, I'm going to pause and write down 1760 for page nine. In case I mess up later on, I can at least come back. All right, going to page 10, plus 25, plus five, plus 15, plus five, plus 10, plus 30, plus 45, plus 15, plus zero, and plus 50. 1960, new page. Looks like we got three more pages. Plus 25, plus five, plus five, plus 20, plus zero, plus five, plus 40, plus five, plus five, plus 40. 2110. Again, I'll have hopefully a timestamp. You can skip all this if you don't want to listen to it. All right, two pages left. Plus 25, plus zero, plus five, plus five, plus 30, plus five, plus 40, plus five, plus 20, plus 40, 2285, final page, plus 40, plus five, plus five, plus five, plus zero, plus 10, plus 40, plus five, plus 15, plus 75 equals 2485. Looks like it, it, it'll cost you 2485 out of the 2500 to claim all the 13 pages. And again, these are bonuses. Um, I believe after the hundred mark is what I'm assuming. Okay, again, um, I don't know. It looks like you can claim all of them by rank 100, including the Fallout first. But I believe that means people without Fallout first have a lot of stamps left over. So when they actually get up to page, the bonus page, they'll have extra to go ahead and start getting into it. I don't know. All right, so what are you guys' thoughts? Again, if I was correct, it was $24.85 for the 13 pages of rewards. And then after that, supposedly is rank 101 and beyond. Let's go ahead. 
And again, this is weird. I, I still don't understand Oops, this part with reach rank 150. That's pretty high. So they're actually wanting you to go through this first bonus page before you can get, actually get to these uh, extras. And again, it looks like these, let me see if there's another one. There is no atoms on the extra. So there is atoms before. Now they are 200 a piece. I don't know if that's 50 more, but still, yeah, I think a lot, a lot of people are gonna complain about them not giving out atoms anymore. Now I can understand that they don't wanna give a lot of free stuff out, because I mean, that is the purpose of online games is to make money with these extras. But then again, you, you can't, you are still limited because there's only so much score you can earn every day, so much score you can earn every week. Yeah, you're not gonna keep ranking through these. I mean, why not just give out 50 atoms at a time if that's what you're worried about? I mean, why still give, why not still give them out? Because I think there are 100 after the 101, starting at 101 within that first 10 rank, you can actually grab atoms again but it looks like no. Now that atom is a fallout first. Let's see if any of the atoms are actually not fallout first. Oh, okay, we do have one. I was gonna say we'd have a riot. All right, I'm not gonna look anymore. I'm actually gonna close it here, but I really would love to hear what you think about this new scoreboard. I was kind of afraid that, yeah, we'd have to go above and beyond the 100 ranking to actually get all the Fallout first items, but it looks like it actually drops right below the 2,500 ticket mark, um, which means people that don't have Fallout first, yeah, I don't know. I'd have to wait till actually I complete the season, but if you don't have Fallout first, yeah, I don't know, are you gonna be feeling cheated because it's not as many rewards? Um, cause it used to, there was a hundred, let me, okay, let's do this. We're just going to count actually the number. So one, two, three, four, five without fallout first, non fallout first rewards. That's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to do to see if non fallout people are getting cheated. So let's do that. One, two, three, four, five, six seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. I'm also gonna subtract one because one of those was a score booster and that really is not a reward. So I believe we're at 18 with the subtraction. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 20, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 32. I was debating whether to count the re-rollers. I think we're at 32. 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38. 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85. All right, without, sorry for the squeaky chair, 85, that's 15 rewards missing for non Fallout First members. Wow, okay, I don't, yeah, I don't know. 
Now let's count what's on here. So that was 85 and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So even, okay, let's, uh, let's say we count these, there's 10. So there's just five missing, but this is the bonus page, but yet they're nice rewards. Okay, so if we conclude these, there's actually five missing for non Fallout First members. Because I don't think any of these were Fallout First. Okay, and then these are just supposedly, I'm assuming, I don't know if these, I have no idea. Like, do you, let's say I grab the lunch boxes. Does the lunchbox behind it, is there a lunchbox behind it and I can claim it again with another 75 tickets? Or do I need to do this entire page? Or do I have to wait till rank 200 for season 2095 to, to unlock the page? I don't know, this is a bit confusing, but again, it is brand new and we're not actually playing it. So uh, yeah, again, what are your thoughts? Oh, here. 3280. So that by the time you get to this page, you're supposed to have 3,280 tickets. Let's go back. So yeah, if you rank 50 more times, 50, 500 divided in half is 250, 250, 250. 250 is 2750. Another 250 is 3000 tickets. Okay, that I, I have to admit this part is a confusing. I have no idea what they're doing. But again, these are just maybe examples of someone actually playing through and that's what they got up to. But it doesn't look like they unlocked anything. I don't know. All right, again. So what are your thoughts? What are the favorite things that you're actually looking forward to? I'll highlight mine again. Let's see if I can see them. Cremator, I'm definitely looking forward to. I think I'll go ahead and just grab all the mods. The Light Alley, Adeline. I think I'm saying her name right. Oh, there's something else. Oh, that workbench. Oh, the water boiler too, but that's a Fallout first only. Um, and of course this autopsy table, I think the Brahmin corpse, maybe, because, yeah, I think that would just probably go good with one of the Halloween sets for decorating Halloween time. Let's see, anything else? Oh, yes, and the must, must have homemade xylophone, because the original xylophone is not enough for me. Oh, wait, 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 I did like the Jersey Stein, Jersey Devil Stein, that was cool. And I definitely want to grab all the mods. I'll just go ahead and grab them. And, oh, this jetpack, because I want to see what it goes on, if it's armor or power armor. And then for the bonus page, maybe the cabin kit, the road signs, maybe the surfboard. It looks like there is another mod. Those are probably going to be my picks. Again, what were your favorite things that you found on the scoreboard? Uh, are you as confused as me? Are you looking for? I'm still looking forward to season 16 because there's still a lot that's going to be going on between uh, the quests that are actually going to be on the map at the location of that mansion um, along with, I think there's two new expeditions coming to Atlantic City. So yeah, again, I'd love to hear from you. Let me hear your comments. What do you think? I'm really disappointed about the Atoms, if that's true. Otherwise, that's it for me. Deathclaw girl out. <laughs> happy gaming and happy trying to understand the new scoreboard. Check you later.